it's Gabby and I'm a research in-house beauty blogger. In today's video, I'll be reviewing the brand new Fenty Beauty cosmetic products with a fellow YouTuber, Howard Breeze. Welcome back everyone. It's me, Howard, we search in-house blogger. I am so happy that you're here with me today. We are going to be talking about the Fenty Beauty Foundation. Now we have a lot to get into, so let's get started. But before we do, please hit our subscribe button, thumbs up this video if you like it, and please don't forget to leave a comment letting us know exactly what you think about this entire Fenty Beauty brand and line of makeup, the foundation, the eyeshadow, just all of it. Let us know in the comment section. I want to tell you that this is not a sponsored video. Fenty Beauty nor Sephora have sponsored this video, but We Search loves Fenty Beauty. So I took the Pro Filter 120. I think it's my shade. It says to shake it really well before applying. I had to buy this from the website itself because on Sephora it says that it's currently out of stock, so I had to buy it from FentyBeauty.com. Um, the shades that were closest for me were the 420 and the 430. And when I got home, okay, and I started playing around with them, I felt that neither one of them was my shade. Then I mixed them together and I literally got my perfect skin tone. So that's what I'm gonna do today. We gotta shake them up. Shake them, shake them. Cause we want this to be good. Okay, so let's apply it on this baby. So the way I apply my foundation is I make little dots on my face. This look a little wet for my skin tone, but I also have my summer tan right now, so this is probably gonna be accurate in a month. I'm gonna use my blending brush for foundation and see how it goes. Now, I'm not sure if it's showing up in the monitor, but I could use a little bit more coverage down in here for my dark spots. But overall, I'm getting a very nice color. Now remember, it has to dry down. I'm, I'm pleased with I'm pleased with how this is. This product is 34 US dollar. It doesn't have a smell or anything. It's not sticky. It's not any drapey, but it's pretty dry. I feel like the foundation is kind of dry and it dries super quick. It doesn't feel like moisture at all. And I have a pretty dry skin already, so hopefully it look good. It doesn't have any kind of sunscreen protection to it and it is not waterproof. The coverage is pretty light if you compare to two other brands, let's say Urban Decay and Kat Von D. Kat Von D like covers tattoo and then Urban Decay is more of a light. Fenty Beauty is more towards the Urban Decay foundation because it doesn't cover Everything I feel like you have to build it up if you really want full coverage. The finish is really smooth I feel like I can leave the house and not put any setting powder because it looks like it's really skin And there's like no cracks on anything. So it's not cakey, which I love it really looks natural And I really like that when I was applying it with my brush It looks streaky at first I could see like the lines of my brush because I didn't buy the Rihanna brush, but I, in my mind a product should work with multiple tools. It shouldn't be just with one kind of tool, but then it's stopping streaky, so that's, that's good. <laughs> I would say that this foundation was not at all easy to apply. Like I really had to go rub it in with my brush. I'm used to having foundation that really like goes quick and it works well, whereas I feel like this is kind of liquid foundation, but it feels like it's not one because the way you have to apply it is like really quick because it dries and then it's really hard to blend in. So you gotta go really, really, really quickly with it. So I don't think that this is considered easy to apply at all. It's quite the opposite. Is this foundation giving me an acne alert? I have a very, very sensitive skin. I will know in a matter of second if a product doesn't fit my skin. And up to now, I'll say that this product does not give me any sort of acne alert. It's really good. It feels very light. It feels like I'm not wearing makeup at all. And I already can feel like the, I, there's no burning sensation or pimple forming because that's what happens to me when I have a bad product on my face. Okay. I'm working and as is a word for a company called We Search. And we really felt like Fenty Beauty connected what we're trying to do. We Search is all about finding the perfect product for you. And and we think at research that it's very important that cosmetics should be to everybody and it's the first time that a cosmetic company Rihanna Fenty Beauty made foundation for every single person of color and again there's only about 40 shades but it's still better than the usual 10 shades that they put out there we Search is all about finding the perfect product that meets your needs and with Fenty Beauty coming out with so many amazing different shades 
that's right up we searches alley thank you guys so much for watching this video i really hope you enjoyed it make sure you hit our subscribe button thumbs up this video if you liked it and please don't forget to let me know exactly what you think tell me have you tried it have you tried out the fenty foundation have you tried out anything okay let me know in the comment section and we'll see you next time bye